Hi, I'm Andy, I'm a video editor, I live in the UK and I'm 39. As a video editor, I sit at this desk making TV programs and uh, not running around getting enough exercise, so as a result, I've got a bit fat. Like everyone these days, I live a pretty hectic life. I've got three kids. <laughs> Hi. Hi. They keep me busy, um, but my working week is pretty sedentary, sitting a lot and uh, having a sandwich at lunchtime and eating crisps. And then I go home and just crash. I haven't prioritized my fitness, so, um, now it's time to start prioritizing my fitness. It's my journey from fat to fit. So my average working day is from 9.30 to about six, but it can go on really, really late. So what I'm gonna do is get up early and start training. The reason why I need to start training is because I've booked myself in for the Bristol Marathon this time next year. So this channel will be my video log, if you like, and I'm going to do it daily. So if you subscribe to my channel, you will hopefully over the year see my journey from, as I said, fit to fat. I mean the other way around. So I'm surrounded by all this top kit to edit TV programs, but I'm actually going to edit this vlog completely on my iPhone. None of this fancy gear. No more excuses. Oh, my computer's broken. Oh, I can't do it. I haven't got the time. I'm just gonna do it on my iPhone, quick and dirty, vlog style. So I've got no excuses, because I have been putting this off because my laptop's broken, which is absolutely ridiculous. But I've been putting it off for 16 years, and that's not gonna happen anymore. Also, I stopped smoking uh, six years ago. So this is my opportunity to use my new lung capacity. I, I stopped smoking using these fantastic things, they're called e-cigs. I still vape, um, but in, I feel like a non-smoker. Uh, there's no smoke, it's all vapor. So if you see me using one, it's not that I'm smoking, it's I'm vaping. Um, yeah, absolutely brilliant. And I'm making a film about them as well, so that's my other channel. So I realize these vlogs um, could be a little bit boring, um, but I'm hoping that uh, I can edit them up to be interesting and use some interesting camera angles, such as this. As you would expect in my profession as well, I'm a bit of a gadget freak, so you will be coming along with me on every run and walk that I do. So you will really see the development of my fitness and uh, all my death. So one of the first things I need to do is uh, do a weigh-in, and I'll do that tonight when I get home, and I'll show you how much I weigh. Uh, so that'll be the starting point. This is day one. Well, let's make this day one. So today I had a, a chicken BLT sandwich, a bottle of Dr Pepper and a packet of crisps, which is pretty normal for me. Um, combine that with zero exercise and this is how we arrive at this problem. Right, so I'm driving home now at 6.30. You saw what I did at work, mainly sitting. I went out to get some lunch and in thinking about what day of the vlog this is, this is day one, but I'm going to use this as a documentary piece of evidence as to what my normal day is before I start the fitness regime. And that will start in the morning. So my vlogs will start in the morning and end at night time. I will also say that my wife has been a big inspiration to me because she's been on a diet now for about four months, five months. And obviously, you know, in everybody's life there's other stuff going on. Um, and that can be a, for me, all those other things were always excuses. They're always excuses. Well, I'll, I'll, I will, I'll go to the gym next week because this week it's really crazy at work. I've been working with someone at the moment who's been a big inspiration to me, uh, Tom, who's doing a, a marathon in, a, in about three weeks' time, and seeing him go through it and train 
has made me think, well, why not give it a go myself? Also, there are a, a couple of YouTubers as well who I've been watching who, who have been a big inspiration. Um, the one that I will actually name check is Casey Neistat. Uh, watching his vlogs and the way he sort of runs his life, it's been inspirational. I'm almost home, gonna have some dinner, sit down, have a chill out, go to bed early, and then get up early in the morning and, and hit it. The other thing that I tend to do is I'm a workaholic, but I don't work, I, I don't work to a schedule. So I will literally get home and then just sort of noodle about on the laptop. And it has been known that I have stayed up until sort of three or four o'clock in the morning on a, on a school night, a work night, and uh, that can't be good for me. That can't be good for me. Right, it's now like quarter to 12. Um, I've had dinner. What did I have? I had um, a sandwich and some noodles. Um, it's quarter to 12 and I should be going to bed now. Uh, we've just watched a film, The Blind Side with Sandra Bullock. It was very good. And uh, yeah, still planning to get up early in the morning and going for a long walk to kick tomorrow's vlog number two off. So I haven't done the weigh-in, but what I figured I'd do is I'll do that tomorrow. Um, do it in the morning because it didn't make sense to have a weigh-in just after our dinner. So, uh, thanks all for watching. Vlog number one is now over.